This video is from my Twitch stream. There is a link in the description or you can just follow the URL that I put on screen. Now I hope you enjoy A Hat in Time. Hopefully everyone's seen this. Hopefully it's all working. Let's just jump right into it. This might be the last episode? Not really sure. But uh, we're getting we're getting pretty close at the end. Uh, I just saw 70% complete on... Oh, he has PlayStation support! <laughs> it's weird. I feel like I sound a little bit uh, hoarse and... Uh, I don't understand why. Halfway! Because I, I was completely fine. Uh, this place. Green. It's in the green zone. Yeah, it's, uh... Gotta go free roam. Hopefully it puts me in the village already. I don't want to walk through all the thing. Yeah, it does. Cool. This game looks a little bit different. I feel. Maybe it's just because I, I haven't seen it in a while, but... But there's something that feels different about it. Okay, so I want to go... <clears throat> oh crap. I forget this is in Mario. I'm doing things in Mario up order. It's been a few days since I've played. Oh wait, I, I can't see the chat. Give me a second. Okay, I can see the chat now. Let's see if I can actually see the chat. That's weird. Okay, I need to fix that. Huh. Alright. Um... I'm just gonna pull it up on my phone. Pull up the chat on my phone. Being super professional here. Boop. And chat. And there we go. There is the chat. There we go. Did, has anyone said anything? No. All right. Cool. I did not miss anything. You're crazy if you don't equip the... The... The badge that lets you keep climbing when you... When you get to, uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. when you use your your uh, jump thing, like this your dive. Yeah, this game, they did something to the game. It, it feels like it looks different. I want to see her model. Did they do something to her? They probably wouldn't, but no, they didn't. Okay, the colors look different. It, I might be going crazy. Might be going completely crazy here. Did I do this one? Yeah, I did. This is the bell one. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, whoops. Yeah, this is right. Alright. Oh. It seems like it's chugging a little bit. The game in this scenario. I don't think it was before. Thank you. Alright. 
platforming. It always gets me super tense for some reason. Am I going the right way? Was there another route? I feel like... Because mm, it definitely looks like... Oh, there it is. There it is. Yes, platforming. The golden jewel of video games. Yes, I said it. Oh, it's a big guy level. It should be pretty easy. Okay, let's see if they follow the classic Nintendo way of creating a level. Teach you the concepts. Use older concepts if you want. Whoa, what's that? Not teach you, introduce. <clears throat> yeah, my voice definitely sounds a little bit weird today. I don't know why. What? No! Okay. Need to be very careful. Alright. This is too easy. <clears throat> I'm gonna fall the moment I... That was... that was too easy, come on. Come on, game. What's that one for? No, I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna try getting the perp. You know what? Okay. It, it's calling to me. Ice hat. Equip it. It was calling to me. I just had to use the Santa hat. I know, I know. I just wanna finish this one. I really like the PlayStation button uh, UI. I'm a fan. It's very clean. That's something I really like about the UI for these games that that are multi-platform. They tend to make the PlayStation 1 flat and very clean looking, and I really like that. And very much into that whole, you know... Oh no, my phone did turn off. Even though I told it not to. Yeah, the contrast seems to be... I think that's what it is. The contrast seems to be a little bit higher. Um... I might be going crazy though, so bear with me in my madness. Uh, so we've been to Bird, we've been to Clock, or I mean Bell. Oh, I forgot I have to hold. Oh, man, it's gonna keep getting me every time. Did the settings of the game change? That might have been a thing, because it updated graphic settings. Da 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh... It's all to standard. There we go. That That's the... That's the problem. I, I had it on very high. That's why it looked flatter. <laughs> there we go. This is what it look, used to look like. <laughs> like, the game looks so flat. I don't understand. But yeah, every time it updates, it resets the, the settings. Which is a bit annoying, but... Yeah. Alright. I gotta do this. Forget I have to hold it. Okay. Maybe not... Ooh, lava. Lava world. No one's favorite, but always there for you. Oh, that was center. Cool. Alright, what's... What's the gimmick in this world? What is this? Can I move it? Oh, I can't. 
they reduced the the um, the depth of field blur. They definitely reduced that because it was crazy. It was just completely crazy in uh, before. I stop. Now it seems to be a little bit better. The game just looks sharper. Contrast still seems to be a little bit higher than it was before. Okay, I went the right way. Going, I need to go the wrong way. I need to go that away. Hopefully this is... Yeah, it doesn't have anyone. So it should be like a side questy island. Which I'm all for. Mystifying Time Mesa. There's a horn. Oh. Yep. Cool. That's exactly what I wanted. I want all the lands that lead nowhere. That's what my quest is. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's getting... Uh-oh, uh-oh. Wait, where, 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 where? I'm not gonna make it. Can I... Oh. Oh? This... Not... Oh! <laughs> I get it. Wow, that, that's a tight time to get up here and do the thing. There must be an easier way. So, that, that was pretty tight time. I'm not gonna complain about it, because I'm actually a fan of that. I expected it to, you know... Okay. No! Well, uh, where am I? Oh! You know what? I'll take it. Huh. Ooh. I don't know if this is possible. Must be, right? I need to do it. I get so close. <laughs> I think it's easier from the top. All right. <sighs> this is pretty tough timing. Okay. I need to... I need to get my boost. Yeah, I need to practice my boosts. My post uh, dive boosts. Because those are gonna be key here. There we go. Like that, okay. Ready? <laughs> now I can't do them. Now I'm stuck, all right. It's all in the boost. Yeah! Yeah! 
There you go. That's how you dive boost. This is a pretty tough island in comparison to how the rest of the game has been for me. I've had a pretty smooth time, smooth, pretty easy time going through the game, um, so far. The horn is up here, maybe? Oh, hat girl. No, hat girl. Ooh. I don't, I don't know about... Okay, what's the challenge here? Do I have to... Okay. Okay. I'm guessing... Okay, so it is doable. Well, I mean, obviously it's doable, but for old rods. No! <sighs> yeah, I screwed that one up. I need a better angle to start off. Nope. Don't you dare auto camera me now. Come on. No. Hmm. Hat girl. Come on. I wish she had more mm, versatility in her jumps. She's pretty limited to how she can jump. <sighs> I would enjoy some life. Um, I just need to get good. That's my guess. Um, okay. Okay. That was so close. That again. This might be a good starting point. Hmm. What? I can't stand on that? Oh well. Here we go. Yep. Let's try that again. All of it. Yeah, I know, I know. I still need to do it. Come on. I'm already slower. Nope. Come on. Yeah! No! Oh, it, it worked. It accidentally worked.
What? That was... That was, uh, a glitch. Call that a glitch. Call that the Kanye West of the game. If you have never seen that Kanye West interview where he says he's the glitch, it is glorious. <laughs> it's one of the moments of pure joy a, a, a person a person can have is watching that. <laughs> it's completely insane. I mean, sure, you know, you go ahead and call him a genius, whatever, but he... <laughs> He's crazy sometimes. Also, I do not think he's a genius. I'm just putting it out there. I do like his his um, his um, whatever it's called. I don't know the the terminology, but whatever it is that the beats behind the songs are like everything but the rapping. I really like it in his. There we go. All right. I am a fan of everything but the rapping in his song. What's that? Just go here and check it out. Okay. Okay. Well, there's one on the other side. This doesn't look nearly as easy. Can I just... I'm gonna cheat it. I'm gonna cheat it. Oh no. Oh yes! Cheating does work. We learned it here first, kids. Cheating works. Actually, if this was the first place where you've heard someone say cheating works. You probably live a very sheltered life, and I feel slightly bad for you. But in the good way, not the bad way of feeling bad for a person. Because, you know, you're growing up to become a very wholesome person. Which most of us will not. You can just keep going, you know? Until it works. I like starting from that one, actually. No, oh, cat girl. Mm. There are some moments where you feel a little bit out of control with her. Which is the worst thing to feel in a game like this. Come on! Okay, what if I go the opposite way? Hat. Hat girl. You don't do that. Hat, what? Hey, 
Can you... You can! Unless you do that. Or this. Okay. I need to get more life. I don't... I don't... I don't... I don't want to go through all that again. Alright, own it! Oh my god. Ooh! Come on, hat girl. Yeah! That's how you save the day. <clears throat> Nothing like some stakes to raise the difficulty a little bit. Get it simmering, get it boiling. Yeah. I don't know what that did. Oh. Oh. Is that it? Is that it? Alright, now we're going to the actual thing. Can I shortcut? Always looking for a shortcut. You gotta be. Girl. Oh, how nice of you. Put me back. Alright. Nice. Alright, let's go grab some of that lava cake. I don't think I've ever had lava cake. It's a big confession for me. Uh, ooh, the Ember Summit. There's a treasure here. I will be looking for it. And in these, they let you turn the camera. When in the other ones, they didn't. I don't understand why. In the Cat Village, the Invisible Cat Village. So, I don't know. There's some weird inconsistencies. That does look pretty cool. Um, trying to look for where the lava cake might be. Okay, we got one of these. One of these and tight ropes. House on fire. Okay. Anything around here? No. Anything on the roof? Yes. Oh. Nope. Just walking on air. Just walking and walking on air. Nope. Nope. I need that. No, I don't. Where's my treasure? Honestly, despite this um, level challenge-wise being, ooh, okay, just let that happen for a little bit. Despite this being the where where the where I want the difficulty to be in this game, I don't know why I'm getting these. I'm, I might need them later. Um, I am not a fan of the theming that much. Okay, I had a lot of time there. I don't like the theme of this map. That's just a p 
personal preference thing. It's not because it's bad or anything. I just don't like it. <laughs> just not a personal favorite. Anything behind there? I just don't know why. It, it, it just doesn't feel quite right to me. This is very Mario Galaxy. <laughs> Very Mario Galaxy. And in a good way, too. Ooh, Firebirds. Can't jump on them, I'm guessing. Alright, that was pretty simple. Let's see what this level brings us. Yes, I would like that. I have 14, 15 yarn, 18. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Just gonna wait. There's no reason to rush. Imagine if this had a timer. It might have a timer later. Lava levels love timers. <laughs> I would not be surprised. Just gonna wait. Just gonna chill. Seems like a secondary challenge. I'll go. Oh yeah. You know that I'm going there. Kind of just want to finish this world up and then probably leave the next world. Um. Uh, Up for the next time. Alright. That was pretty simple. Just a token. Nice. Okay, I just need to jump down. They're pretty good about this. These levels are pretty good about this. The backtracking, they, they're positioned in a way that it's never painful. I do like that. That's some good level design, in my opinion. You might think that that is terrible level design for some reason, and be like, they should never have done that. But, you probably wouldn't, I would think. Ah, stupid guy. So far, lava challenges, pretty simple, pretty, ooh. Brewing yarn. Forgiving. All right. This doesn't look too forgiving. It might be. Ooh. Almost screwed myself there. Checkpoint. Thank you. Ooh. I might checkpoint, but. This is my last life. 
Nothing? No lives? Alright. This is it, boys and girls. I either make it or I don't. Ooh. Oh boy. This looks challenging. Now the question is, can I pull this off? <gasps> Come on, game. <laughs> oh, I'm probably getting back to the beginning. No, I'm not. Okay, the game is nice. The checkpoint is a full checkpoint. <laughs> yeah, because that would be really frustrating. I. I understand why the slightly generous checkpoints, because if your game has things like that, where it, where it clearly should have gone over, but it doesn't, that would be frustrating if I died. I don't understand these things yet. What are they doing to the people here? Are they turning evil? Alright, only one left. Did the lava. Hello, you. I don't think I've seen you here. Okay, yeah, you don't have anything else uh, completed. Okay, that's the twi- That's the twilight bell. The windmill, yeah, the blue one. Old windmill. Goat outpost horn. Okay. Oh! <laughs> that caught me. By surprise. I was not expecting that. <laughs> At all. Did it scare me? No, it just startled me. Although some people say that startling is scary. Because that's all jump scares do. They just startle you. They don't really scare you. Anyone is scared of jump scares. Because they're literally just startling you. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, death. That's nice. Um. Alright. Ooh, it stays down. That's interesting. All these little ooh moments for me today. Or are they always there? Okay. Huh. The illusion of choice. I like it. Okay. Should be able to do it now. Okay. Why doesn't she have the shadow when she needs it most, which is jumping on this thing. I can't see my own shadow. Can I jump here? Yeah, okay. It was useless though. Where is the horn? Okay. Oh. <laughs> you know. Yep. I got it, kid. You might not have noticed, but that is a quote from the Star Wars. When Handy Solo says it. Oh, so that was a joke? It's just a generic line that Handy Solo happens to say. Is 
this progress? This is progress. Do I need life? I don't think so. Doesn't really matter. Pick it up anyway. I'm trying to, th to think why it is that I don't like this and trying to see if there is any other reason other than me just not liking the aesthetics. There's just something that rubs me the wrong way with this level. Like, it, it seems fine on the surface, I just... I can't really put my finger on it. Here are the big guys. I wonder if I could stop there. Can I just drop? No, I can't. Okay. I'm in for the ride. Windy Passage. Guessing this is it. Ooh, whoa, that's a lot of them. I wonder why they're here and why they seem so sickly. I'm guessing they are infecting the local populace, but... Like, why am I doing it? Why are the things that I'm doing causing this? I don't get it. Why does uh, getting to the top of a lava cake, getting in the bell and doing a thing... Like, getting these time things don't really change anything in the world, per se. Doing other things did. In the horror world, it changed the... Uh, it changed the... Sorry, the, it, the, the time things didn't even change. It was uh, killing the, the fox spirits that did. So it was a separate thing entirely. And then, as a separate thing completely, we, re we were... Where, 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 we received... Um, the time time piece for killing them and doing other things but time pieces don't seem throughout the rest of the game to have any direct effect on the world they don't seem to be like a center like a like you could say that this right here whenever i get in then it opens the flowers that's a thing that it does but there's no reason for that to be there you know what I mean? It's like... Oh my... I hate these cats. There's no... reason for it to be happening, but... To use a different example of a game that's very much like this, let's go to Sunshine. Where, uh, Let's say, a boss. The first... The first boss? Let's go with the second boss. There's a the second boss of Sunshine. It's when you're at a bay and all of the local people are like, we we can't do trade. We can't send things in or out because there's a huge squid uh, on the uh, on our bay on our on our port. And then you go in and you destroy it and you get a star from that. But what you did by destroying the by destroying the uh, the squid, you change the world and you change the level because of that. Here, it seems arbitrary. The time, getting of the time set, the time pieces, and uh, the getting of the time pieces and uh, the world changing. It, there's no like connection with what you're doing. You're not doing anything for the flowers to change. Uh, you're just getting a, a time piece. So that's just one thing that I'm like, hmm. When it, it was alright with the other levels because none of them had like world reactions like that. Like they just stayed there in the first world, in the mafia world, the. Alright, let's blow this. In the mafia world, when we save a uh, mustache girl for the first time against that pile of TNT. 
We were not really, um, nice. We're not really, like, changing anything. The barrel pile still stays there, which makes no sense after that battle is over. Um, so just things like that, just small things that I guess aren't so small, just, they just go a really long way uh, to building the world and making it really feel alive and make it make sense too, where everything you do just kind of like joins up with how the world is changing around you and here the things you do don't seem to have a connection to why the world is changing. The, it could have just happened randomly that those flowers start releasing the, the pollen or whatever it is. It, it just feels arbitrary, I guess that's it. The windmill. Wonder if Petey Piranha is gonna be in there. Hat girl. Hello, you. Do you have any new badges? No, you don't. Alright, that's not climbable. So yeah, just in general, world inconsistencies like this, not being able to climb. I think we're at a point in just like gaming in general where this is becoming less and less common, where rules of are games are being created more with general rules that always work like if you can climb a wall you can climb any wall and even if it doesn't really matter but the best games will make every wall matter uh, and again it seems like I'm I'm just like tearing this game apart I'm not I really like this game and I'm and all these things in the grand scope of the game being good or bad are pretty small. But there's still things that I think are worth bringing up because this game could be better. Like how the the bearings don't really turn either. Just the little details, little details. I want this game to be better than it already is, and it's already pretty good. Um, I see. It's one of those tricks. One of those. Anything here? No. Anything down there? Ooh. Take you guys down first, and then get ready for this. Ooh! Ah, uh, come on. I don't have time. I don't have time. What? How do I? Heck, girl, come on. Oh, that's a present. <sighs> Alright. I think I'm... Now all these presents aren't giving me relics anymore. Nice shortcut. Um, so I, I think I'm done with relics. I think I got all the relics. <laughs> Which I'm pretty surprised with. There's a very limited amount of relics. Alright, here we go. <laughs> here I go again with another nitpick. There shouldn't be any reason for you ever to have to climb a ladder in a platforming game. 
Every climb should be a challenge. It is, after all, the whole purpose of the game. It's to climb things and jump and get to places that you couldn't if you didn't have the ability. And if you fall, that should be still a puzzle. Even if you want to make it easier. Make it fun to climb. Because, like, if you keep falling in one... Whoa! Whoa! That was... Surprise. If you keep falling over and over and over... In the same spot, which hasn't happened. I don't think there are any spots, so this... Doesn't really apply to this game, but... I've played some games where that does happen. It's just frustrating. Um, but in games that where that does happen... What's the point of this? It looks cool. Oh no, wait a sec. <laughs> it, uh, it's frustrating. I mean, obviously, right? And, uh... This looks very different color. Um... 23... One more, we get the cool hat. Um... Uh-oh. I lost chat again. Half a second. Just need to open my phone. There it is. It's back. Oh. But yeah, it gets boring if you, like, have to redo a part over again, and it's a boring part where there is no challenge. Like here, I'm gonna get to to do something. I don't have to just like climb. And it, it's despite it not being really a challenge to jump on the sandbags, it's satisfying. That is a satisfying way of doing non challenges, I guess. Because it feels good. The sounds are like bam, 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 and it's like yeah, yeah, I'm doing that. All right. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Thanks, carts. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Come on back. No. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> All right, I can't do that. Oh. Phone almost fell. All right, where are we? Cool, cool. I don't know if I'm wrong about not liking very lenient checkpoints. I feel like I might be wrong. Because I say, you know, I don't want very lenient checkpoints, but at the same time, like, this is the part where I'm having trouble. If I have to redo a whole section that I've already accomplished before, where's the fun in that? Is it even fun? Or am I just, you know, does it become busy work and having more forgiving uh, checkpoints is actually a good solution? Because my gripe up to now with checkpoints is that, you know, if they're very forgiving and they put you right where you stop, it's like, where's the punishment for dying? Like, then it just becomes easy. It's, uh... I think a good, very good example was, uh... When I was playing, uh... Metal Slug with a friend, but on the, on the Switch. And, you know, you can get as many lives as you want in that. And you just, you actually input tokens as if you were on an arcade, but instead, you know, you have infinite tokens, you do whatever you want there. And he brought up a very good point, and, and it's that... 
if you can just... This game loses its a little bit of its charm, but yeah, it still looks good. It's great, great um, pixel art, whatever. But it loses its challenge because you just have infinite lives, essentially. So something that was challenging and hard and fun to beat when you actually got through it, that is completely lost. And I completely agree. So, but where is the limit with that, right? When does the... The, uh... Checkpointing in this case, and in the case of most games, most games don't have tokens and whatever. But where does that end up? Where do we... Where's the limit? Where it should be the limit? And I guess that's still like a thing that game designers still struggle with because we see so many games that are like, ugh, have to do all of that again? And games where, where it's like, you know, this is kind of easy and people don't usually complain, but it's the, the easy ones are the ones that people just end up leaving. They're like, eh. I've had my fun with this. Unless it's really good, and it makes you keep going. Um, it becomes boring. Um, a game that presents no challenge is not really fun. Um, and one level that I, I played recently won't spoil anything. It's pretty much the final level of Odyssey. It makes you... It's a pretty long level. I don't think that's spoiling anything. It's a long level, and uh, it makes you go back to the beginning every time you die. And I was a fan. I got frustrated, though. I got frustrated because I died a bajillion times. But I like that. It was the type of thing that I got frustrated and I came back another day. But it was so good that I wanted to keep going and keep trying but is that the, should that be the case with with most games will people give most games that sort of pass not even a pass it like it felt like a good challenge but will most games with their quality get through that because a mario game is a very specific game those tend to be good games in general. I feel like you can jump there. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Um, anything else? Um... Maybe get over there, I see. Is that it? There's stuff over here... Is this progress? Yeah, it is. So there was stuff on the other side. I <laughs> can't go back. Uh, I guess I can. Oh, whoops. Can I? I don't know how I went outside. Was that it? Wasn't it? Was it? Yeah, it was... Oh, okay, no, I'm right. I came out from where I was wanting to go. Um... But yeah, so that's something I think about sometimes when I'm playing games. Just, I guess it go, it, it's a game-to-game -game basis, right? I'm not saying that there should be a, a rule, like different games will require different settings for that kind of stuff. But uh, where is the the right spot for each game, I guess, I'm wondering. And, uh, see, this is a nice one. This is a nice spot for you to, on a different topic, 
nice spot for you to lock my camera. That works very well. Also, it doesn't make sense that there are bird studio bags in here. I just literally need to walk around. Alright, 31. So from what I understand, there are 40 of these timepieces. Alright, I think we have the finale of this area ready to go. Do we get to see these guys become evil? Yeah, there we go. The illness has spread. Hopefully we get a little bit of the backstory of why this illness spread. Oh, it's purple. It's evil. Because this is the situation where if Hat Girl is the one who spread this, then, you know, she's very much the villain in the story here. Okay, where are we going? Where are we going? We're we going to the top. Do I have to go to each of the areas? That would be insane if I just had to recomplete all the areas. Oh no, they're blocked. Okay. None of that. None of that. I probably just need to get to the peak of this area. Probably need to go around. Ooh. Just noticed that I have no idea. Okay. Oh, okay. Wait. I do have to go. See, I, just from concept. Oh, this is a new island. Okay. I was about to say from concept. Just from concept alone. Not a big fan of just redoing levels. But this is a different level, so why? Nothing to complain. <laughs> uh, or is this a new level? Well, I guess difficulty is higher because of things falling, if it isn't a new level. I just don't recognize it. I guess that's another thing. This level isn't very memorable to me. Just like, it... It's either so big, still trying to figure it out in my mind, it's either so big that, you know, the moment to moment isn't very recognizable. Or... It, do those hurt me? They probably do. Or it's just too big for me to keep in mind every every place that I've been to here. Okay, so what do I do? Alright. Do I... their shortcut? Do I walk back? Seems like walking is the answer here.
I don't think I have anything left to say about this part. <laughs> I kind of ran out. Oh, there isn't one there. Interesting. Hmm. Just three? <laughs> That's weird. I mean, yay for not having to go through all three of them, but like, it's weird. If it's right, I hope I'm right. Oh, uh, please don't. I've never, never said that. Ugh. Was I wrong? I was wrong, wasn't I? That girl, come on. It was left all along. have so many pawns. They kind of became useless after I got all the... all the, uh... Oh yeah, I forgot. Holding. They kind of became useless after I got everything I wanted. Um, not really any incentives to use it elsewhere. actually chasing me. I was just here. Is that what it is? No, it's not because I'm... This is... This one might be it. Maybe the, the time thing was bringing back a play from a distant time where, you know, the sickness, the illness was a thing. But now... Are you down? Yeah, okay. And it was, like, messing with time. And it would bring back this ancient illness. And, uh, that would be interesting. I would not be against that. Um, would really like, uh, for that to be explored a little bit more. If that was the case. I think it's, it would be a cool idea. But it's definitely not a case of, like, they left it for the imagination. They left it all to the imagination. I think... You know. I don't know. I like the game. <laughs> I, it's annoying that... Well, I feel that I have to keep saying that, but... Usually people attach to, you know... the if, Even if you say something... It's just a little bit negative. They're like, oh, you hate it, don't you? It's like, no. No, I really like it. Really like this game, but it's... It has flaws. It has a lot of flaws. It's still a great game. None of them are game-breaking flaws or anything like that, but... They're still there. All right. Sizzling lava split. I'm guessing I'm going this way. What? What? Where was the next spider? Where was the next spider? Okay, it wasn't a spider. It was a one of those. Okay. 
What? Hat girl. Hat girl. Come on. Don't mess with me, hat girl. Yeah. <laughs> you should not be that excited, buddy. You should not be that excited. <laughs> some life. Thank you. More pawns. Is there anything else I can use pawns for? If there is, I can't really remember. Not really coming to mind. Checkpoint. I wonder if... I, I might have missed it, but I wonder if this game has a hard mode where it only checkpoints in the beginning of the level. That would be interesting. That would be interesting to play that. Now, another game I'm considering playing, even though, you know, all the DMCAs and whatever... Okay, I'm gonna go that way. Is, uh, Mario Odyssey. Because, oof, I I'm loving that game. I am loving that game, and it's definitely worth... I would replay that whole thing. I'm over 600, I think. Yeah, I'm over 600 uh, moons. And, uh, oof, it, it, it's incredible. I, I can't complain. I cannot... Oh, wow. Oh, no. Okay. I just... Cannot come. Whoa! That was a weird jump. It was a very weird jump. Oh no. I have to redo the. Okay, no, I don't. Um, I would replay that entire game. I love it so much. I would. I would have a lot to say about that one. <laughs> I've had a lot to say about this one, too. Yeah, yeah this is hard because the plants are already in the way. I have to jump over them. I wonder if the difficulty is raised... Thank you. There we go. Depending on the order you do it, so like the third one is always harder. Or if they're just different challenges. Like see, none of the NPCs mentioned anything. They might mention it now, but like none of them mentioned anything. In the beginning. Yeah, like, we don't even understand it. Alright. That's my time for today. Do you guys hurt me now? No. Alright. Bim, bum, bum. And that's one more world finished. That leaves us with the last world. And the last world only only has eight. Uh, did I get a new challenge in here? Yeah, ooh, a blue time rift. I might want to do that. What's the blue time rift? It's the windmill area. The windmill. 
does it take me to the windmill immediately? I would enjoy that. Yeah. However, I think I need to go back. The game does not want me doing this. See, things like that, these are pre-programmed to face me the right way. You know, just let it be what it is, even if I'm facing the wrong way, according to the game, which isn't the wrong way at all, it's the way I want to go. It's the way I want to go. Oh. But yeah, they're in one of these villages. No. Yes? I think I see it. It might... It might be this one. Is it there? I think I see it on the house. Oh, it has a... Hmm. No. It's not. Hat girl. Has a windmill behind it. So I'm guessing. Uh, how do I get up there? Just through the other path. Seems like it would have been faster if I just went through the normal means. Maybe this can help me. Oh, oh. hoping feels like it's around here Or at least that it could be. Really, that village. How do I get to that village? Uh, um. Hmm. Also, how is that a challenge? The bridge, the falling bridge. <laughs> uh, you, you, you literally just, if you don't stop running, you're fine. Okay. It just leads to the horn. And you, mm, how do I get there? Maybe there's something on the other side. There might be something on the other side. Possibly not, but hey. If there was and I just missed it, that would have been really annoying. Yeah. There didn't seem to be. So 
so much for platforming. So much for platforming. Alright, no, we're, we're gonna get there. Gonna get all these pawns. Give me these pawns. Alright. Bang. I need to find a way to get to the village up top. Is that one only available? With they all have villages, don't they? Not windmill villages, though. It's the village with the cats. Is it that one? Is it that one? I mean, this is one of the cat villages, but... I really didn't see any, like, indication that this was it. I mean, I guess it could be, I guess. I'll go with it. I'll go with it. It's in a cat town. This is a cat town. Yep. It's here. I was just being an idiot. Yep, it was the big windmill in the back. Uh. Stole my cake! Give me my cake! Should've just gone with my gut. Ooh. Alright, I don't wanna- I don't wanna be spoiled. <laughs> Not that it really matters. Uh, anything here? Anything here? No. Ooh. <sighs> really? This is the challenge of this platforming level. <laughs> Invisible cats. Come on. What? Kill me. Alright. That seems to be all of them. Is that it? Really? Really? This is the worst challenge. <laughs> mm. bum, bum. Sorry game. But this one this one was pretty bad. Nope. Nope. Ooh, yes. I'll, I'll equip it. Looks pretty cool. Looks pretty cool. I barely use the normal hat anyway, so. It's kind of useless, really, because they, they give you pointers whenever you need to go somewhere, so. The searching mechanism of the hat doesn't usually come into. Ooh, ooh eh. oh yeah, I remember what's going on in the story now. <laughs> um, yeah, let's go to the next area. Let's just look at it, see what it is.
to the attic. Chapter Time's End, now available. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Oh. Oh, they're all hidden in their things. It's a box. Oh. This is new. No, it's not. Okay. Oh, it wasn't even timed. Uh, can I see inside of this? Yes, I can. Mm. Oh, bet this, these are like if I get certain achievements or something. Let's see. The finale. I don't even want to open this. <laughs> this is definitely going to be next time. Definitely going to be next time. I'm not opening the thing that says the finale. <laughs> yeah, so if that's only going to give me one or two. Um, one or two uh, time thingamajigs. And uh, I also need to find the last place for my relics. Because I, I don't think I found... Was there one here? No. Um, I think there was one in the new area. Um, but yeah. Then I'm missing a few from challenges in other areas like this. Uh, well, not like this. Like the area we were just in and finished. There are probably more things. Also... Also... Ooh... I need one more... Here. Here. Here it is. Yeah, now I have this. This, 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 and this. There we go. That's all my relics. It's a match! You've identified a relic from this strange planet. Hmm. At this point, I already forget what the... These were made for vandalism, definitely. Even I feel compelled to take these and draw on everything. I can only conclude that this vandalism toolkit must be illegal. That makes this relic extra rare. If only the package hadn't been opened. Only a monster would open a package of a... Collectible? Eh, that's a bad spot for a light. <laughs> There we go. Oh, I can turn it. For a... of a rare item. Okay. But yeah, I think that is it for me. There are a few... I think I'm gonna try... Am I actually gonna go completion it? <laughs> I'm gonna try getting a, a few extra ones, not today, but like on the next episode, so it's not just like one thing. Okay, so this isn't the first level. That one's probably pretty easy to reach. Um, what about Mafia Town? So Ma Mafia Town doesn't have one, but does it have normal challenges I haven't completed? There- ooh! There's one platforming one. I'm pretty close, so that's two. Two from these other levels that I haven't completed yet. What about Horror World? Horror World has another one, so that's... Three of them. Three, four... And I have one left in the... So, five. How many do I have? I have 33, so... Two that I can get in the new world, or maybe even just one. I'm gonna check to see if there are any other ones in this one. Because it's either two or one that I can get in the finale level. Oh! Two. Two. 
can get to on the finale level. Cool. Good to know. Oh, that's it. What's this? Emergency button. Perfectly designed for moments when you need a button to push but can't find one anywhere else. Hmm. I do want to push it. Anyway. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Next time we are probably going to finish the game. I'm going to do some cleanup with these remaining levels and then we go to the finale. So that's going to be fun. Uh, but yeah. Until then. I don't have a thing to say. Just take care. <laughs>